Hello YouTubers, Rockmonkey Jr. here. And as always on Sundays, live comms. Playing on... From what I can tell so far, my least favorite map in Battlefield 5. Hamada. I don't know why. I, I, I really hate it. What? Go down, spawn beacon. I want it to go down. There we go. Yeah, this map, especially maybe I got a bad taste in my mouth because of Conquest Assault, but Conquest Assault on this map is, pardon my French, absolute fucking garbage. No, no. Oh fuck. Oh. oh. Okay. So yeah, I'm playing. Apparently, I auto spawned with the sniper. So we're just gonna go with that. But. What is good about the about the recon class is you get access to the throwing knives, which I absolutely love. <laughs> so we're just gonna roll with this. I mean, this this map gives you long, medium to long range combat engagement anyway. So, whatever. We're just gonna roll with this. Oh my god! Look at all the people over there. That 99? Oh, okay, that was because of whatchamacallit, the spawn. Okay. Go, go up the rock! Oh, there's a lot of people here. Poke your head out. At first, I, I was a little bit taken used to, to play with the snipers, but, um... I was complaining because... You didn't really have the opportunity to get a one-shot kill unless it was a headshot, even close court combat, but the more I play with them, the more I'm getting used to aiming for the head, and oh boy is it fun having a blast sniping people and blowing their brains out. No. Please don't shoot me. Where the hell is everybody at? No, oh, I thought I heard somebody right there. Probably gonna get my face blown off. Oh man, no! Damn it. I'm gonna go over here. You definitely have to think a lot more about how you play the game though. Battlefield 5, because the. TTK is not forgiving at all. Oof. I'm gonna try, try and take a peek from up here. Oh, potato aim for the win. There we go. My bad right there. That was awful. Oh man! I pulled the throwing knife out. Come on. So off to a rough start. Off to a rough start. Come on, medic. Don't be shy. Give me a little bit of that 11. No, definitely not doing shit. Oh, the throwing knife kill. Oh, double kill. <laughs> that was dope. That makes up for the shitty start. That right. <laughs> oh, that was great. I love using the throwing knife. I think it's the only class that can have it though, which is unfortunate. I'm in a bad spot. Don't die. Oh. There we go. People right there. Hey, buddy. I think I hear somebody else. Not sure though. Nope, 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 nope. Not taking that fight on. 
Oh my god, there's a dig. Those guys getting massacred up there. Oh my god. There we go. The bipod at MGs is what you gotta be careful of. Because those things are insane. Who's shooting over here? Hey, buddy. Oh, oh, nope, nope, nope. My bad. <laughs> oh, no! That dude scared the shit out of me. That dude scared the absolute balls out of me with his Suomi. Holy hell. Too bad it was low on health as well. Oh, I should have taken the shot before. He was jittery, that guy up there. So yeah, I've definitely been having a lot of fun playing this game. A lot more than I've had with uh, Battlefield. Hey! Coming, buddy! Oh. Oh, no! No! Oh, my God! That was an ambush! Or they just spawned there. I don't know. That was... <laughs> that was bad. Let's try and get a... Oh, there's somebody there. Pretty sure that hit him. Did that knife go through him? What the hell? Dice, please. Thanks, dude. I do feel as though the game is still unfinished. And it should have been, like, honestly, there should just be three-year development cycles, or three years between the games and now. Not two years. It's too little for the devs to get everything out ready in time. But it probably is one of the Battlefield titles with the best gunplay so far. Um, nope. That missed. Oh my god, what the fuck hit me first? Something you really need to get nailed down like ASAP is the audio glitches and bugs and shit. Nope. Oh, whoa. Easy there, tiger. Wow. They were just getting shot from every angle. Don't know how that wasn't a headshot. Whew. Barely saw the peak of his head right there. There's somebody below us. Oh, they're behind us. Okay. Oh shit, I thought that was an enemy. He scared the bejesus out of me. They're gonna start coming behind us. I can feel it! Whoa. Hit that. <laughs> oh, that's so fun. What up, buddy? I love that they added throwing knives to this game. That makes me so fucking happy. 
Oh. <laughs> I think I've gotten more more kills with my throwing knives than anything else this game. Okay, there they are. That was bad aiming right there. My, my sensitivity might still be a little bit too sensitive on the mouse. Sometimes when I flick shot, I'm a little bit off. I think I'm gonna have to turn that down a little bit. Tweak it a little bit more for Battlefield 5. But they. Oh my god, no! Wow! That dude just chewed through me. Oh, no, medic, you're gonna get screwed. Oh my god! How? How? He's a legend! No! Oh! That was just... <laughs> I'm getting revived again! No! Oh, come on! <laughs> Damn it! Hey, we won! That was a pretty good game. I got, <laughs> I got a lot of throwing knife kills. That was fun. Ah, uh, that was fun. Throwing knives are... I hope. I wish every class would get throwing knives, to be honest, because that is so much fun. Whew, that was an intense game. So, if you guys haven't had the chance to play Battlefield 5 yet, if you only ordered the regular version, luckily this week it's the release, so we're going to have a probably a large influx of players yet again. And I'm definitely having a lot of fun. Keep your eyes peeled for some videos, uh, tutorials this week to for Battlefield 5. Um, as well as my favorite weapon and class setups for each individual class. And don't forget to leave your monthly Q&A questions in the comments down below. There'll be a pinned comment there. Put all your questions after that. And while you're down there, be sure to hit the like button if you enjoyed the video. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, as I try to release Battlefields and other first-person shooter-related content pretty much every day. And as always, thank you very much for watching. I really appreciate it, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a good one.